All over the world, young people are leaving rural areas. What can make rural areas more attractive for young people? The yards are educated professional young women and men from rural areas. What role can we play in addressing the challenges of living and working in rural areas? restoration of services have concentrated first in the cities and as a result those who migrated to the cities many of them unemployed but don't see the rural areas as an attractive place to go back to for the first time we thought this would be our job our challenge to make sure these children go to school we've been trying to set up some uh, short-term vocational exchanges mm -hmm. just to get them to go back. The issue of uh, climate change is uh, a very, very important concern to every one of us. People depend on wood, on charcoal, whatever, to, to keep their life moving. So if we tell them stop doing that, it means they'll die out of hunger and poverty. Afforestation could be an excellent social business. You can create miles and miles of forest through social business. A social business, as I defined, is a, is a business for the purpose of solving a problem. In, t in this time, it's a logging and all illegal logging. All this problem can be resolved. Is there any possibility, let's say, carbon financing to reach mm. these uh, small families in rural areas? Money is not your problem. Grameen Bank is sitting on stack of money, waiting for you to ask for money. So you ask any amount of money, that's no problem. For any amount of time, it's not a problem. So you think what you do with the money, that's the whole issue. For us, uh, the most important thing is to develop so social uh, community. The time it took for a decision to be reached at the kind of long-lasting insecticide treated net to be procured. And uh, I think this is a local governance issue and uh, issues to do with the decision making. We have to look at uh, various cultures of, of people and, 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 their, and, and their education background. I'm representing the youth of, rural youth of Mongolia, so it's not even my personal choice. It's all over the, <laughs> the Mongolian youth's choice just to send me here. I really liked what Professor Muhammad said, uh, that we should respect each other. So uh, that's uh, also uh, one of the mission and one of the most important things in uh, our team as a Yards. It could be a movement along the world, uh, all around the world. Young people making a, a particular pledge, saying that I shall not live a life where my enjoyment of life will hurt the enjoyment of life somewhere else with somebody. Mm -hmm.